Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today's video is the Cold War Org. The Cold War Org was by far the most dominant weapon in Warzone Season 2, and it was rightly nerfed into the ground because of how busted this thing was, with how quick it could down people at long range, and they also changed the 3x scope, which made this thing even more powerful. The Org, though, has been buffed with the latest Season 5 Reloaded patch to give the recoil a little bit more reduction to make it easier to use over range the burst time is still really slow for the org and i think this gun is definitely not the best option for range in season 5 of warzone however it does provide a fun alternative if you're looking for something a little off meta to try this thing does still hit really hard if you can hit your headshots and be really accurate but I definitely think there are better options. However, in this game, you can see it used and you can decide for yourself if you want to give this a go. I'm rocking the Agency Silencer here for the best effective damage range as well as some recoil control. I'm using the Field Agent Grip to help with the recoil control a little bit further because this thing still does kick a lot, especially if you're running this barrel, the Strike Team barrel. This is a faster fire rate, which means you've got less time in between bursts. I prefer the strike team because it does give aim walking movement speed and it also helps the fire rate compared to the titanium which only does fire rate and then the 3x is how you want to go i think for this if you are a 4x person definitely give that a go but i really prefer the 3x using the 45 round drum it is more than enough ammo for this gun anything more you just end up hurting your ads which is extremely important for ranged engagements you want to be snapping onto your targets so that they don't escape, especially with the low burst speed. Uh, I'm using the PPSH here as a backup as well, because I think the PPSH might be my favorite new SMG after the patch. It just does everything really well. It's got great movement speed, great ADS, good fire rate, and it's great up close, as well as pretty decent in a sniper support sense. Using the Gru Suppressor, the Task Force, Tiger Team, Raider Stock, and then the 55 round drum. This is a pretty decent game. It's lower kills than what I've been posting lately. However, I really wanted to showcase the org changes in the new season. So thanks for watching and enjoy. Oh, that's a full four, dude. All holding each other's hands. Jump out this window. The mechanics of this game sometimes just make no sense. Too. 
Let's go see. Marking waypoint. Where's the guy on the res though? They got the res. Jumped off. And they like crap him. Okay, it's gonna be two v four. Bad one. There, there. Oh shit! Right here. Sucking in. Make for target location. We've got gas moving in. Can use this Take house to push star. through. Gotta get in there. That guy's not. Got no plates there, bro. Okay, he died. He's pushing over right in front of us. Yep. Two v one. We just stick together. Serious. Oh, Let's go. Here we go, teamwork. Jesus.